Well, this was a lot sooner than anticipated. I guess I forgot to lock out the hydraulics. Yep, you guessed it. We're starting second cotton. So we are starting second cotton sooner than I anticipated. And I just want to say how incredibly dry it is. And that's kind of why we're going to cut what we're going to cut. We want to get something uh, before this stuff starts to wither away to nothing. So I'm going to be cutting probably about 11 acres today. Um, it's not very high. It's probably not even close to knee high in some spots. But something is better than nothing. So here we are July 14th and we're starting the second cut. Since July 1st we've got point, point seven seven inches of rainfall. Um, June definitely wasn't that dry. There were a few, you know, decent rains. But for the most part the last three weeks, the last week in June and the first two weeks in July have just been bone dry. You can see everything is brown. I don't need to cut the grass. The grass in my front yard is just, it's crispy. up against the uh, sorghum field that I have that I planted, Sudan sorghum field, and uh, man that field is very, very dry. Not only is it <coughs> insanely dry, but the, uh, the Sudan sorghum is actually turning like a light green. So I talked to a, a buddy of mine who, who plants that every year for, you know, baleage, silage, whatever. Um, and he said that, you know, it's in dire need of nitrogen so and water. So <clears throat> I'm hoping, it's supposed to rain on Sunday. I'm hoping that that actually happens. 
and then <coughs> hopefully I can get this stuff made, get her fertilized, and we'll have another good second cut out of it.